Pope Francis and Christians around the world marked a solitary Easter Sunday, forced to celebrate the most joyful day in the liturgical calendar amid the sorrowful reminders of the devastation wrought by the coronavirus pandemic. Families who normally would attend morning Mass in their Easter best and later join friends for celebratory lunches hunkered down at home. Police checkpoints and closed churches around the globe forced the faithful to watch Easter services online or on TV. Read more. Pope live streams his Sunday address amid coronavirus outbreak, says he felt caged. A few lucky Romans participated from their balconies overlooking Santa Emerenziana Church in the northern Triesa neighborhood, where the priest celebrated a rooftop open air mass. At the Vatican, Francis processed into a largely empty street. Peter's Basilica for Mass, celebrated before a handful of token faithful sitting one per pew and with the choir's Kyrie hymn echoing off the bare marble floors. Story continues below advertisement 122 Coronavirus Outbreak, Pope Begins Holy Week Amid COVID-19 Lockdown Coronavirus Outbreak, Pope Begins Holy Week Amid COVID-19 Lockdown Normally, Street. Peter's Square would be awash in fresh flowers for Easter, with tulips and orchids decorating the piazza's promenade in a riot of color to underscore Easter's message of life and rebirth following Christ's crucifixion. This year, however, the cobblestone piazza was bare. Police barricades ringed the square, blocking the tens of thousands who would normally flock to hear the Pope's Mass and noontime ubi et orbi speech and blessing to the city and the world. Read more, coronavirus, what is herd immunity and what does it mean for COVID-19? Francis instead celebrated mass inside the basilica, decorated with only a few potted palms and white hydrangeas, rather than appearing on the basilica loggia to impart his blessing, Francis was to speak in front of the tomb of street. Peter, underscoring the solitude confronting all of humanity amid lockdown orders and quarantines to prevent further contagion, sign up for our Health IQ newsletter for the latest coronavirus updates. It was a scene repeated around the world, with churches either closed or, for the few still open for mass, forcing the faithful to practice social distancing. In South Korea, where one outbreak was tied to a church sect, services were largely held online. A small number of masked faithful attended service at Seoul's Yodoful Gospel Church, one of the biggest churches in South Korea. They were seated notably apart from each other, and choir members sang hymns from behind masks. Story continues below advertisement 151 Coronavirus Outbreak Pope Francis calls for global ceasefire amid COVID-19 pandemic coronavirus outbreak. Pope Francis calls for global ceasefire amid COVID-19 pandemic at Jerusalem's Church of the Holy Sepulchre, where many Christians believe Jesus was crucified and entombed. Archbishop Pius Batista Pizza Bala urged the faithful to not be discouraged. Despite the sign of death and fear that we are seeing everywhere all over the world, we have to look at the good all those that are giving their lives for the others, he said. Only a handful of clergy were on hand for the Mass and the streets of the old city surrounding the church were empty of pilgrims and vendors. Read more, Premier Doug Ford declares Easter Bunny essential service amid COVID-19 outbreak The message of Easter is that life, despite all, will prevail, said Pizza Bella, the top Roman Catholic cleric in the Holy Land. The Church of England shuttered its churches, prompting the Anglican Archbishop of Canterbury, Justin Welby to celebrate Easter Sunday service from his kitchen in London. The spiritual leader of 85 million Anglicans worldwide, Welby delivered his sermon in full robes behind a makeshift altar on his dining room table. Welcome to the kitchen of our home on Easter Day, he said. Once this epidemic is conquered here and elsewhere, we cannot be content to go back to what was before as if all was normal.
Story continues below advertisement 152 COVID-19 makes for very different celebration of Easter weekend COVID-19 makes for very different celebration of Easter weekend in New Zealand, Catholic bishops wrote a special pastoral letter to worshippers stuck at home, acknowledging the stresses and uncertainties of this Easter like no other but urging the faithful to take comfort in time with family. This time has proved to be a reflective time enabling us to refocus or revision ourselves and how we live, the letter said. In Lebanon, home to the largest percentage of Christians in the Arab world, Cardinal Bashar Arai urged the faithful to abide by lockdown measures, which have been imposed as Lebanon endures its worst economic and financial crisis in decades. Read more, Coronavirus Pope Francis holds Good Friday service in Empty Street. Peter's Square We are praying so that Lebanese officials work together in the spirit of collaboration to revive Lebanon economically, financially and socially, Rai said in an almost empty church in Bkirki, northeast of Beirut, the seat of the Maronite church he heads. Church would normally be packed with people marking Easter, including the President, Prime Minister and Parliament Speaker. For Orthodox Christians, this Sunday marked the start of Holy Week, with Palm Sunday services held in similarly barren churches. Story continues below advertisement 052 How these Canadians are celebrating Easter, Passover virtually How these Canadians are celebrating Easter, Passover virtually Pope toward Ross II, the spiritual leader of Egypt's Coptic Orthodox Christians, celebrated in a largely empty monastery of St. Bishoy in a desert valley west of the capital of Cairo. The church made the prayers available on its official Facebook page. The Coptic Orthodox Church, one of the world's oldest Christian communities, had decided earlier this month to suspend Easter prayers and celebrations at churches and monasteries to contain the spread of the virus. View link copyright 2020 The Canadian Press Journalistic Standards Report in Aralette's block ads. Why?